$10,000, big deal. It's literally a number. The, the thing that we want to see is when the trend begins and when it ends and when there are some ups and downs along the way to the final top. All right, guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video, we are talking Bitcoin. It's going off $10,000 with the past that. We're at $11,000. I think you can all read a chart. You can all see what's going on on any website telling you what the price is. So what I thought I would do is run through some of the videos that are on YouTube and just let you know what I have seen in them and whether they are worth your while or worth your time looking at them. Now, it's got nothing to do with any of the people, you know, like there's a lot of good information in a lot of these videos, but really it's all the same sort of information. If I can bring that to you in a much shorter video, which is what I'm trying to do here in under five minutes, then hopefully that saves you the time and the effort of watching video upon video of 10 minutes, 20 minutes, one hour streams, all this sort of stuff. And then you just save your brain time to actually make the trades because the hardest part is actually getting your money together, implementing it on a plan if you've written a plan up rather than just listening to people on the internet like myself and then applying that plan, you know, putting money in and just relaxing with the emotions, whether it's the buy time or the sell time, you know, getting in or out of a trade. Uh, so I'm just looking at this. I've got a little bit of a different setup. You can see my face down in the bottom corner. I've got the YouTube videos in the background there. At my end, it's starting to flicker, so I'm not sure when I go to edit this whether that comes up on the video too. So I apologize for that if that is showing up there. First video I'm going to look at is my favorite, Bob Lucas. He has the most simple plan. And I probably talk about this in most of the videos. It's just buy Bitcoin and just hold. Not it calls it the hodl method, but it's not exactly hodl because we're going to sell when we think the time is right. And he's got a plan there for about three or four years. Uh, we're going to look at different parameters, that sort of stuff. In that time, I would suggest studying technical analysis because that's essentially what this is coming from. Fundamentals, I think they just take too long to play out and you can just, you can gravitate towards either end when it comes to fundamentals. So I don't always see fundamentals as being the most reliable for a new trader. Moving on, Bob Lucas. Uh, okay, so yes, his video that was on from yesterday. We are talking about here the Bitcoin accumulation price discovery. He's just saying from the 4,000 entry point, and that's his part of his plan, getting uh, 25 Bitcoin at 4,000 USD. He's got a Bitcoin address there that you can follow along and just see where his money is actually going in and out of. So that's a, that's a real thing. He's put 100,000 US dollars in. It is now 150, probably more than that percent since that video of 21 hours ago. Uh, he's just saying, I've got nothing else to add to it. That, that's his video, which I, I love the honesty about that. It seriously is the four year journey, the hodl yourself, you can see there in these other videos here. Hold, three, four years, that's, that's all it is. He just wants to reaffirm that for people and just let them know this is what he's doing. He's got a couple of exit points, but overall, it's pretty much the hodl method there. All right, I'm getting up in time here. We're at around three minutes, so I'm gonna move along. Uh, I'll come back to this one at the end and jump across to, I think this one was Sunny Decree. Yeah, uh, look, Sunny's just like a beginner new trader. He's actually trading. Um, he's got some basic charts here. You know, it's kind of what everyone else looks at when it comes to these bigger term cycle analysis. Yes, we see a little accumulation stage in those little orange boxes. The red boxes are the, the bear markets. And then yellow is the next part of the accumulation stage outside of the low point. Essentially, that's all it is. He's just saying this is where we're headed, talking about a couple of small trades and then talks about some news articles. Again, I'm not that interested in the news itself. I want to understand what everyone else is talking about on the net. Give that to you in as short of a time frame as possible. And we're at four minutes. Let's scoot along here. And then hopefully you can just get a feel for what's going on out there rather than having to look through so many of these YouTube videos which are all the same. Bitcoin, the modern investor. This guy puts together really nice FOMO style videos. Um, they're well made, got good music in there. There was one previously uh, about why Bitcoin should go to $10 million. Like these, he, he puts up excellent headings. Bitcoin above 10 and a half, next up 100 grand. Like, this shit is 
really getting on the emotions. You know, all these new traders will want to see this 100 grand Bitcoin, Ethereum, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so he puts together nice videos, but at the end of the day, it is just all absolute basic information. And that's fine. Like that is quite helpful. That's the modern investor. CryptoLark, uh, he's good at giving you the news headlines, talking about the news. In terms of trading, uh, we know he's not a trader. He doesn't claim to be a trader. That's sweet. I like CryptoLark. He's uh, very entertaining when it comes to explaining news stories. But apart from that, there is really no other information that personally I use for trading. It's just, edu it's not educational, it's uh, infotainment. It's, it's uh, interesting and engaging. Last thing I'm going to look at here, because I didn't touch on Data Dash, which I usually look at, but in this case, let's just look at the headlines. I've put in the word Bitcoin, that's for today. I'll just hit enter again, see if we've got any new, any new additions here. Sunny Decree, Modern Investor comes up for me. They're going to be different for your end. Altcoin Daily. All right, who we got? Altcoin Buzz, uh, same deal. They're just, everyone's putting up a bigger number, which is probably what I'll do for this video as well, because it's just to catch attention. All of these videos are essentially the same. Uh, Alessio, I do like his channel. He talks a lot about technical analysis. He's not always right. He says that, but that's life. Tom Lee is... They, uh, he's got his hedge fund. He has been wrong about Bitcoin for the whole time. And this guy manages, I don't know if it's billions, but it's definitely in the tens of millions, maybe hundreds of millions of dollars for other people. You can see these people, no one has any idea what's going on. Bob Lucas plan, it's like a nice simple plan, buy and hold. And then you just wait for the absolute hysteria to come in to sell. It's a simple plan. Even these hedge fund guys have got no idea what's going on. Uh, my favorite is old mate here from Silicon Valley, Tim Draper. But by man, we know he's got nothing going on there. And apart from that, there it is, Token Vision, $10 million. So it wasn't the modern investor, it's uh, Token Vision. That was the video from yesterday. 10 million, 10,000, all of these videos, exactly the same. If you want to you feel better about your decision, go and watch them. If not, this video will suffice for all of the current news that's my point of view, of course. That's why I watch these. That's why I put this video out to hopefully save you some time. $10,000, big deal. It's literally a number. The, the thing that we want to see is when the trend begins and when it ends and when there are some ups and downs along the way to the final top. We get some nice drop-offs like Bob Lucas says of 30, 40%, you know, some, uh, uh, some falls from intermediate peaks. Then we want to buy again buy the F and dip, BTFD. That's all we need to know about this bull run. I'll catch you guys again. I've made it under 10 minutes this time rather than five. I promise these ones are gonna get nice and compact. If you wanna talk more about crypto, if you wanna talk more about investing in general, go and check out the Facebook link that I have left down below in the description. Uh, so that's Optimize Your Wealth on Facebook. It's a small, tight group of people Property, mostly Australian property because there's more Australian people there. However, I'm not closed to talking about property in different parts of the world. We just need to build a bigger community because we want to know what we want to do with our crypto gains come two, three years, four years time when you know we've, we've made a shit ton of money from uh, Bitcoin and other cryptos. We can't just leave it in there and watch the bear market you know, take all of the profits. So it's really setting up a nice investment plan moving forward. I'm talking about smaller businesses. I'm talking about masternodes in crypto. I'm talking about how to create some other sort of pass passive, you know, semi-passive. You have to do work to get that. Uh, investments, everything else, optimize your wealth. Go check out the link down below. That's where we'll catch up when we're not on YouTube together. So if you like that, let me know. Like, dislike, I wanna hear your comments in the comments section. Thanks again for joining. I'm on Instagram, Facebook. See you at the next video. And until then, remember to have more fun, get more done. Peace out.